Malcolm here, Fandoms Anonymous. I'm here with the man himself, the Red Space Ranger, Andros Christopher Lee. What's going on, man? Oh, uh, I'm good, man. <laughs> this really is the I'm, man I'm, himself. I'm, I can feel that. The, the, there's only one Andros. That's true. There's only one yeah. Andros. Some respect yeah. has to be put on your name. Sure, it has right to now. be. Yeah. How you doing, man? I'm good, man. I'm having a fun time. Conventions are always fun. Yeah. I can now finally cross you off my list. Okay. Every time I have a range, literally have a range of lists. Like I need to meet that person. I need to meet that person. But how are you enjoying Atlanta? Is this your first time in Atlanta? No, this is a uh, second time in Atlanta. Awesome, awesome. And uh, yeah, it's it's been a hell of a lot of fun. Now, what are you? Th what are your thoughts on Power Rangers 25 years later? To still see what you what you 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 helped start this. You were in that that bracket of this is the beginning. This is a new thing. This is a new thing on TV. Angry parents saying no violence and all this stuff. But now they let their kids watch this other crap on television. Yeah. How, how does that feel to, to see the relevance still 25 years later? Um, honestly, I'm really not that surprised. Because I always kind of figure, I mean, you know, the show's been going on in Japan for like 780 years. I mean, it's... In Japan, it's, Japan time is different. Yeah, it is. You know? um, so, you know, I'm really not surprised because, you know, you look at the show and what do you got? You got a bunch of kids running around, flipping, kicking things, martial arts, violence and all that. Of course, everybody's going to like it. Right, right. I like it. So, right. Yeah. So, I definitely not? like it. So, yeah. Now, being a Red Ranger and seeing all the Red Rangers that have come before and after you, what is it like being a part of that? Because that, that's a fraternity in itself. What is it like mm. being part of that group? How did you feel when you were selected? to get the role for Red Ranger. Oh, God. Really? You asked me that? <laughs> okay. Do we want the truth? Truth, yes. Oh, okay. The truth is, is that I did not want to get the role. I did not want to be a Power Ranger oh, at man. all. I had no interest in it, period. When I was a kid, I grew up in Virginia. I had very long hair. Very, right. very long hair. We, yeah. And when I had very long hair, I would wear it in a ponytail. And when I would wear it in a ponytail, all the other little kids in my neighborhood would come up to me and say, you got hair like Tommy. Your hair is just like Tommy. So You look like Tommy. And I didn't know who the hell Tommy was. So I was like, I don't know who Tommy is, but I already hate him. I don't know who this is. So that kind of put, put something in your mind like I got, I I got kind of picked at and stuff in a, in a way like, you know, yeah. I don't want nothing to do with this. Yes, exactly. That is exactly it. So yeah, like years later, I get the uh, I get the uh, call that you know, hey, you're gonna go out for something. And I was like, oh okay. I lived in Miami at the time, mm -hmm. and my manager, she was like, yeah, go out for this. And I was like, what is it? And she said, it's Power Rangers. And I was like, nope. <laughs> and then she was like, don't worry, just go for it, just read for it. You probably won't get it. You get it. Of course. It, it was like those stories where somebody says, yeah, we won't have it. No, it's just a of contest. Course. And then, of course. Bam, you get it. It is. The, the greatest secret to auditioning for not just Power Rangers, but for anything, if you go in and you make them think that you don't want it, they will immediately hire you for it. The less you look like you want it, the more they want you. Your next job this interview. is not a joke. Yeah. <laughs> On yeah. your next job interview, go in. Wear an unironed shirt, you yeah. know, but have good credentials. Don't, you know, go in a ragged resume. <laughs> right. And then, bam, you're going to get the job. You will get the job. You heard it here first. Yep. <laughs> Thank you so much for talking to you're us. Welcome. We really appreciate it. We're here with Christopher Lee at Ranger Stop and Pop Atlanta. Andros, Red Ranger, creator of the Z-Wave. We're having a good time. We'll see you guys later.